Good afternoon, everyone. My name is David Target. I am one of the graduate assistants this year in the Office of Gift Planning, and I have with us today my fellow graduate assistant, Nicole Ziegler. How are you today, Nicole? Good. How are you? I'm doing well. So in typical fashion, can you just tell us a little bit about yourself? Um, where are you from? How you ended up at St. John's? And what are you studying now? So I'm originally from Queens, lived here, born and raised. Mm -hmm. I actually decided to go to St. John's with a big influence from my dad because he's a fellow alumni. Mm -hmm. And now I'm studying to get my MBA in business analytics and hopefully take that into the finance field. Awesome. And what was your undergraduate degree in from St. John's? My undergraduate degree was finance. So awesome. I can so combine both of them. Awesome. So as I said earlier, Nicole is my fellow graduate assistant in the Office of Gift Planning. Um, can you tell me, tell us a little bit about your experience, how it's been working in the Office of Gift Planning for four months now? I absolutely love working with my fellow teammates at mm -hmm. the Office of Gift Planning. It's bittersweet because with everything happening with the coronavirus, I haven't been able to meet everyone in person. David right. and I have been in classes together, but in undergrad. So now I haven't been there. I haven't mm -hmm. met anyone, but getting to work with everyone through zoom is so amazing like you feel connected with them these right past absolutely and i mean i feel the same way it's it's a, such a shame that this pandemic is here because i'm sure it would have been great getting to be in the office with everyone every day but thanks to technology we're still able to get our job done um one of the great things about being in the office of gift planning that i'm sure you agree with is that we get to interact a lot with the alumni um unfortunately as I said earlier, the pandemic has kind of hindered that, but um, we still get the opportunity to do it, whether it's through Zoom or over phone calls. Can you just talk a little bit about how have your interactions been with the alumni so far? So, so far, I've had great interactions with right. the alumni, especially the McCowns and the Lachlan's. Mm -hmm. Getting to know them over the phone is kind of difficult, but the people I have talked to, you get to like really see their stories, what they've grown up with and especially like how now technology and the coronavirus are affecting them right and, yeah I completely agree like it kind of just it like reaffirms why you chose St. John's when you hear all these great stories from the alumni it, it just makes you realize that this is a special place it is a family and that's one of the great things about St. John's is how everyone is still able to stay in touch um so because we are doing the student donor appreciation series um this is the big question. I just wanted to ask you a little bit about what does your scholarship mean to you and how it has helped you um, over the past couple of years? My scholarship, without it, I would not have been able to go to St. John's. It mm -hmm. helped my family tremendously. Everyone that was able to input a little bit of money just to get my scholarship to where it was really helped further my career at St. John's and helped me get my undergrad in finance. And now mm. I get the privilege to go for my master's in business analytics, thanks to my great job with um, as a graduate assistant right. in good planning. Mm -hmm. And I feel like that's how so many students feel that without the support of our alumni, many of our experiences wouldn't be possible. So on that note, I just wanted to thank Nicole Ziegler for being our student donor uh, appreciation individual of the week. Um, it was great. I know our alumni are going to enjoy this. So thank you, Nicole. Thank you for having me.